top eight. Excuse yeah. my hair game right now. It is a little <laughs> bad. But grand finals here. I love watching uh, Seth and Ally play. They, yeah. I feel like they just bring out very entertaining, high-level matches. Yeah, because they like to utilize every movement option that they have, so they're constantly just dancing around each other yeah. and creating a beautiful dance of damage. Yep, back and we're, now yeah. we're seeing Seth stick with the Falcon. Yep. Falcon has been his go-to today. Not not a lot of cloud we're seeing. We didn't really see a lot of cloud from him. We've yeah. mainly just seen the Falcon. We saw the dock and pools. Oh my god, the footstool oh. ally with a legit zero to death. Anyway. <laughs> Um, Just shake Seth, head ally. Seth is, should be very accustomed to this matchup. Yeah. He and I had a very long history of uh, having very close matches mm -hmm. with each other in this very matchup. And he's definitely had very a, a lot of matches against players like Surge, Nam, and Lou Rich. Yeah. So this is one of uh, Seth's most known matchups. Yeah, I mean, Sheik in general has to be somebody's most known, one of their most known matchups because yeah. you need to know. You're going to run into a Sheik at one point or another. Yeah, it's like the, it's a very similar to the Meta Knight matchup in Brawl, you yep. had to know it yep. in order to succeed. Ooh, wow. Actually manages to trade with it. I believe it was a traded with a jab? Almost. Okay, that backer's gonna kill. It looked yep. like a down tilt, actually. Really? Yeah. Okay. Now that's one of those things we'll have to go watch when it's back on, when yeah. it's on YouTube. Which you can watch on Gucci Gaming's YouTube channel. YouTube.com slash Gucci Gaming. <laughs> We're here for plugs. Yep. Oh my oh, god. god. <laughs> Beautifully timed up smash. The disjoint on Sheik's up smash is a thing of beauty. Well, depending on if you're on the receiving end or not. True. It can be a thing of horror if you're the one catching it. Yeah, and that was definitely a very horrific thing for Seth Sational there. Yep. Because Seth is down a whole stock here. And it's very difficult for Fal like Fal actually no. I take that back. It's it's fairly easy for Falcon to make a comeback against Sheik because uh Falcon has a lot of uh quick aerial tools that do work on Sheik. Primarily the down throw into knee. There's actually certain percent ranges yeah. where it's guaranteed on Sheik. Yep, good option, just smashing right through that jab. Down oh. but we got bouncing fish, guys. Yep. We're chic, we don't die here. <laughs> this is oh. super chic bros with DLC. <laughs> 59.99 to play chic. Yeah, I did play 60 bucks to main chic. <laughs> Catching him with that back here, and now it's only a 55% deficit. Looking a little bit more doable for him. Yep, and that's one thing I was kind of like, kind of like hinting at earlier, is that Falcon actually has a lot of tools to make quick comebacks for Sheik. Yep. Quick, quick juggle opportunity. Yep. Sheik is a fastballer, so she's very susceptible to uh, quick and good aerial games. But just like that, you gotta watch out though, as you're, if you're a Falcon, you are, oh my gosh, these footstools, oh, my God. ally. I was going to say, not to another footstool. That, all right, Nair to dash deck, I like it, I like it. Both characters in that kill range. All right, that's oh 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 that's it. <laughs> wow! Um, Just catches him with the tip of the fist. Loki, that I've been there in countless sets versus the Reed brothers. Yeah. It, get it? Like when you have when you put in so much work mm -hmm. and you have this great percent lead, yep. and then all of a sudden Falcon's just like, "Yo, give me this Raptor up air, up air, boost, me Raptor boost," and, and then you just die, and yeah. then you're very sad about life. Yeah, that's definitely one of Falcon's greatest strengths: just the ability to combo people. All right, we got game two here. Ally still sticking with Sheik. Really? I'm not, I'm jealous. Anyway, what's going on over there? We've had a we've had a very non esports uh, streamer today from what I hear. <laughs> he he's not esport. He, he he's not very esports. He's very esports. <laughs> if you catch my drift or my Snapchats. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we do have fun here, though. Oh, Michigan. Speaking of having fun, Sensational and Ally are just going at it. Yeah. I mean, these two, they 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 do play quite a bit. Yeah. Um, but normally when we've actually seen them play, it's normally like Ally going Cloud or Ally going Mario. This yeah. is one of the few times I've actually maybe seen Ally opt to go Sheik first set. Yeah. 
and let alone Seth opt to go Falcon against him. True. Actually, that's very true. Yeah, because he's been going Cloud a lot lately. Cloud is officially Seth's coach. Yeah. Well, I mean, when you want to do doubles, you definitely want to have a Cloud in your pocket. Yep. Ooh, good job catching that jump and get up. All right. That, okay, uh, this is just me being very, oh, that, that, that was disgusting. Oh, wow. Um, this is going to be me being very nitpicky about uh, Sheik. Ally does not utilize uh, perfect pivots at all with his Sheik. And if, if he does, that combo where he got 34% yep. could have actually been about like 55 to 60, ending with a mountain fish. Yeah. So he's definitely still got some work, but because of his core gameplay and general understanding of the character, he's still able to give a lot of people a run for their money. Yep. That's why I want Sheik Ditto this man. <laughs> I want to take that money. He may beat me in random Ditto's, but I think yeah. I can win a Sheik Ditto. Kappa. <laughs> Kappa boss. Oh, Ooh, see that soft hit of the air. That was one of those situations where uh, Falcon can almost get the guaranteed knee. Yeah. But I think he was just a couple percent off. That should have been a back air. That could have been an up smash. Ally, learn. Well, he got the stock anyway, so it's working for him. True. I mean, I gotta remember, this man is sitting in grands, and I'm sitting here at the commentary <laughs> desk at 17th place with a certain someone. Hashtag cluster. <laughs> Hashtag why did I think I could win the Arcadians? <laughs> anyway. <sighs> Sensational. Down one stock. Ally fighting back. Trying to take this stock and get this set one match closer to being over with in this tournament. So we can say bye-bye three stock. Yep. Um, 123% though. Ally does need to be careful. That uh, one quick raptor boost, one, one back quick air. back air, definitely would end the uh, life of a Sheik here. Yep. Especially with that weight reduction. Yeah. It's, it's actually good. crazy that that one, that little one weight drop actually did pretty, actually affected how you have to approach uh, being at high percent. Mm -hmm. Like you don't get that extra like five-ish percent of being, knowing you're safe. You have to account for rage a lot yep. differently. It's a little bit of a struggle, but you know we're chic players. We're born to be. Sh we're born to, with a struggle. Yep. We the struggle kill. of the admiration and love of the entire Smash community. Yeah. Yeah. It, we're, <laughs> we have the strain of not being zero, so we all just actually suck. Yep. But yeah, that is the downside about Sheik. If your gameplay isn't on point, your opponent can punish you. She Sheik's the character that if you're not playing perfect, is bad. Yep. You all, if you are not playing perfectly, your character's bad. Ally, however, taking game two, showing that his gameplay is good enough. All right, game three, t sets tied 1-1. Yep. Ally coming from winner's bracket. Go figure. <laughs> and Seth making the very long climb through loser's bracket. Yeah. <laughs> Did he get knocked down early? He lost to Ally in the oh. finals because of that second spot. Yep. Yeah, there were some slightly odd seating today, but part of that may have been there was with very, how the pools there were was some sorted very out. Questionable seating today, but you know that's beyond that. That is uh, for a different time. Yeah, and uh, I mean maybe, honestly, maybe yeah, I mean honestly, <laughs> all in all, I'd say the tournament was well run today. Personally, so I'll give it my uh, verdict after this grand final set is over. <laughs> Ally, boom, four tilt nair, four tilt nair, looking pretty smooth out in here. Pound City, back. game number three. Ally, total control and just domination over this yep. uh, Sensational right now. All sitting with that up here, but Sensational ready for it. And Ally just can't hit these easy, easy peasy, lemon squeezy <laughs> uh, con oh. confirms off of uh, side B, and then he Sensational dies. Sensational is able to hit his though. But well, with him sitting at 140%, he's going to be getting knocked around a lot. Oh, there we go. All right. Good up smash. Gets him with the second part of uh, down smash, kind of like when you're on the, you've got your hands out. Yeah, the second part of the up smash. I like that. I really like nice. that. Ally, good stuff. That quick 0 to 68, and he is just wow. back in the driver's seat. Yep. 
That is that is some technology that I would real I'm gonna like start trying to find a way to incorporate that a little more. That F tilt, F tilt grab, forward throw into an up tilt punish. Good stuff there by Ally. Oh, Looking like he's been he actually has been labbing up this Sheik a little bit more. Yeah. And as time goes on, it's only gonna get scarier. Oh yeah. Ally a monster player in his own right. Arguably top ten in the world currently. Oh, the ledge trump. Oh. That's a he quits out. Yep. Sometimes you know when it is time to drop out. Like you're saying, all right, you know what? Done with that match. Yep. A little flustered here. Take a quick breather. Yeah. Try and save. Readjust. Mental state. Readjust. Maybe that wasn't the right stage. Yep. Oh, and Seth going Sheik. butter chic from Butter Falcon. Now Seth does have a chic. Okay. He's always had a pocket chic, huh. and it's mainly for situations like this when he gets very frustrated in the chic matchup. Mm -hmm. Who's gonna hit first? Set hits first. Yep. And One. he's still hit. All right, quick 29%. Very smart to not go for the third bounce, the yep. third kick of Bouncing Fish. It allowed him to land safely yep. on the platform because Ally had the innate fear that Bouncing Fish 3 could hit. Yeah. Because that damage just racks up the more that Bouncing hit, Fish hits. Yep. Like a salmon upriver. <laughs> oh. Almost getting tilted off the stage there. Ooh, okay. Clever. Alright, nice bouncing fish by Seth. Good job shielding that. Now, I actually like what Seth was going there with the down air. Mm -hmm. um, he was trying to two-frame ally, and yep. that actually would have spiked. Yeah, because if you're grabbing the ledge with that explode, the up B, it doesn't actually put out a hurt box when it grabs on. That's correct. It's just a win box. All right, ally jab. Reading the landing with a jab F tilt. I really, that's some interesting yep. stuff. The way some of the th unique, the things that like ally is doing is very like, okay, I, I, I see how that, I see how that works. Yeah. Huh. That's optional. By no means out of this yet. No, it's a chic ditto. Yeah. Chic is one. Chic dittos are one, one where comebacks are real. Yeah. Because a chic with rage is kind of annoying uh, to get um, to actually like hit yeah. as a chic with no rage. So yeah, every time I watch like Ally do something, I'm like, man, you know, if Void was here, like Void would have just like done a lot more than yeah. that. I mean, that's one of the things that you also have to take into consideration when you're facing a character. What is that player's personal spin on the character? Yep. <laughs> okay. Oh. Bo both both players properly. Yep. Ally using getting a lot of mileage off with this uh Sheik Nair. Yeah. Oh, Ally, very smart smart to tech that. Mm -hmm. Woo! That was cool. Seth could have just punished that back with his own uh, up smash, but yeah, F tilt could have actually killed. There was potential. Yeah, with Sheikah uh, down 50 throw, 50-50. Seth chooses the correct 50. Well, he chooses the correct 50, but he didn't definitely did not choose the correct DI. That man DI yeah. straight above him, held, holding straight back. Yeah, you definitely want to try and DI to the side a little bit, make it a little bit challenging for the Sheik to follow you. Yeah. All right. Ally just gonna just do, go for the him. pummels. That's honestly at this point, um, it's actually yeah. pretty smart to just go for the pummels. Because with this much rage and this much, you're, damage you're not gonna get pummels. anything. You're up. Yeah, Sheik's just up like throw, that. Sheik's up throw does not yep. kill. Just go that for the pummels. Get just rack on more percent. You're not gonna like Sheik's gonna be able to get back on stage from Sheik no matter what. Yep. All right, but Ally now with no rage is going to try and have to find a way to get this kill here. Yep. And that's one thing about the Sheik Ditto that makes it very possible for comebacks to happen is that when Sheik hits that uh, golden percent of uh, being above max rage yep. and a Sheik does not have, like, any rage, it's so hard to get the kill. Yep. All you can do is just keep on trying to rack up the damage until your options kill, or you can just do Damn. a nuppy. Uh, very bold read by yeah. Ally. Yeah, because if that didn't hit, he would have been wide open for a punish. Yep. All 
right, Ally getting these forward tilt oh, wow. chains because of the platforms. Man. Oh, yeah, that was a nice, like, quick 39%, though. Yeah. Nice get up attack. Sheik's get up attack, uh, one of my favorites. Mm -hmm. Very strong. It actually does a lot of shield damage. Yeah, there's a lot of get up attacks in this game that you got to watch out for if you're trying to shield next to it. Because if your shield's already low, you're in. It could break. Exactly. All right, rapid jabs. Forward air to Seth, bouncing fish. Seth Ooh. being lapped, but wow, that tipper up smash. Ally yeah. might have been caught sleeping on that DI, yeah. maybe not DIing at all. Yep. Or maybe he was just at the golden percent of just enough rage and just the perfect amount of percent. But right now, Ally trying to find a way to close out this stock and this tournament. Will he go for the vanish? Nope, nope. just goes for the nair. Resets the situation. Ally does not go for the... Oh, you know, just as I'm going to say, like, you know, Ally really doesn't go for yep. the vanish 50-50. goes and does it and wins the tournament. Yep. Go figure. All right, guys. Ally takes that... 3-1 yep. over Sensational. Uh, Sensational.